anybody to a party if you leave their glasses empty all the time. Well, it ain't everybody who slows it down as quick as you. No. Thank you. Take the sandwiches and drinks around again. Yes, of course I will, Mark. And Dan Archer, for heaven's sake, take that glum look off your face. Yeah, I was thinking about Mirabel, Doris. Oh, oh she'll on. be all right, Dad. Mm. She's carved out any trouble before. Besides, Ned's with yeah. us. Of course yeah. he Come is. Come on, Jimmy, grab another sandwich. Oh, thanks, Mr. Trigar. I say, what about a song from Uncle Tom, then? Yes, yes. come on. Forward the forest. Yes. Oh, all right, Dad, yes. yes. Come on. Hey, well, well, let's have when Jonesy's hair was new, Tom. I trust you to be thinking about drink, Mr. Guy. Right, old Walter. Jonesy's hair it is. Uh, are you ready, Phil? Yes, right up. There were three jolly fellows came over the hill together, came over the hills together to join our jovial crew. They called for bottles of wine and sherry to help them over the hills so merry when Jonesy's ale were new, me boys, when Jonesy's ale was new. The fuss to come in was a tinker, he was no small ale drinker. There wasn't a small ale drinker among the jovial crew. He swore he'd mend any pans and kettles, his rivets, he said they were made of best metal. When Jonesy's ale were new, me boys, when Jonesy's ale was new. And the next to come in was a dyer, he sat himself down by the fire, for that were his desire among the jovial crew. He told the landlord to his face, the chimney corner was his place, when Jonesy's ale were new, me boys, when Jonesy's ale was new. And the last to come in was a soldier with a firelock over his shoulder. What man could look more bolder among the jovial crew? He swore to fight for the king and his crown and knock all hungry rascals down. When Jonesy's ale were new, me boys, when Jonesy's ale was new. Right, that's a good old song, that is, John. Yes, very nice. Here, have a fill-up. Let me serve you for a change, Jackie. Oh, what's your hand? Who's this? Late visitor? Come in. Why, it's Ned Larkin. Hello, Ned. Here, yeah. anything wrong, Ned? No, it's all right, boss. Give us a lovely car for us. Oh, good old Mirabelle. Yeah. A bull calf? No, one of the milk well, I reckon. Oh. oh, that ought to take the furrows out of your brow, Dad. <laughs> now you can enjoy yourself. Yes, and what about a drink for the midwife, oh, eh? Oh, <laughs> give Ned one. Oh, thanks. <laughs> and while I'll be having one, can I hear my mate, young Jimmy Grain, sing a song? Oh, do you oh, think yes, so? Jimmy. Oh, I loves to listen to him and his guitar. Oh, well, come on then, Jimmy. All right, old Mr. Archer. In Scarlet Town, where I was born, there was a fair maid dwelling. Made every youth cry well a day, and her name was Barbara Allen. It happened in the month of May, when the green buds, they were swelling. Sweet William on his deathbed lay For love of Barbara Allen So slowly, slowly she got up And slowly she came nigh him And all she said when she got there Young man, I think you're dying Oh, father, father, go dig my grave Go dig it long and narrow Sweet William died for me today I'll die for him tomorrow
<laughs> uh, that were proper good, young Jim. Thank you. Well, I don't know whether you lot have got homes to go to, but it's time I was off. Yes, time we went to, Jack. Oh, there's no hurry. Ah, we've all got a good day's work to do tomorrow. Except old Walter, of course. Aye, now, careful what you must aim, Jack Carter, or else I shall take me custom away from the bull. Yeah, I on that a shake, yeah. <laughs> It'd mean a hefty fall in the takings, Jack. Yeah, right. Hey, but just a second. Uh, before we go, do you mind if I have one last request? No, go on, Uncle Tommy. Yes, what is it? Well, uh, I just wondered if I might hear that quartet. You know, uh, when we are married. The one you saw at our wedding. Oh, oh, oh why, of course we'll sing it, Tom. Delighted. Come on, John Tregarden. And you, Doris. And Chris. Strike up, too, will you? Yeah, right, who? <laughs> Come on, then. When we are married, why, what will you do? I'll be as sweet as I can be to you. I will be tender. Don't! 